All righty. I'll give you a bit of a live update. I seem to be getting further and further behind um, with uploading these videos, and some of them I waffle on a bit and explain a few things a bit. You'll see at one point the uh, laptop ends up with bloody malware on it. I've fixed that. Um, you guys have seen the first tomato. Well, there's tomato number five ready to be picked. I've been uploading these videos every... You know, trying to upload them every second day. Sometimes I just couldn't be stuffed and it's every third day. Realistically, I'm going to have to upload them every day because I'm getting so far behind. I've got a lot of them uploaded, but I've just got to put them public. And even then, I still haven't got all the ones that I've um, shot as of last week. I never even managed to get them all uploaded uh, when I was at the library. Um, yeah. Maybe I shouldn't drag on and waffle on so much and uh, should just uh, do a daily roundup as opposed to uh, talk about a lot of smaller things and show things multiple times a day as it progresses. Maybe it should just be a daily roundup. Anyway, if you uh, teaser alert if you don't want to see what I'm up to in a few seconds. I'm hoping to go off to China's New Year celebration thingies. I know China's New Year was on the 8th, uh, but they're going to have a big wending down at uh, Chinatown in the capital on the 14th, which is probably when you're seeing this. Um, it's 13th today, so tomorrow I'll be going off down to the capital. Uh, it's trying to rain. I was hoping to do a particular thing on the house. Anyway, I've dragged the cardboard house frame around with my car. Oh, uh, not the frame, shit. The floor around with my car. Um, and it was in too shaded an area to actually realistically use as a hot house. So around here at the front of the house, uh, there's plenty of sunlight, you know, comes in through all here, obviously. And uh, anyway, building a heated hot house. It's going to run off... Uh, basically a homemade wood heater using old car propane tanks and uh, rocks as thermal mass because we've got no shortage of rocks. So that's what's been going on. The other thing I've been trying to do and intended to do today and my batteries is dead for the cordless angle grinder. So I'm charging up both of those because Cutting all those in, uh, those cool room panels up, shit, it burns through the batteries pretty quick. I was intending to. I've got to check the weather forecast and really question all this again, unfortunately. Um, get all these brandish sheets off here, all the warp ones. I've got to replace this gable, which is what I'm going to try and do. Instead of having a barge board, uh, like a lot of things with this house, it's all a little bit sketchy. They've got a, more or less a bit of 3 by 2 covering over there and I'm intending to get those off and move the flashings in a little bit after I replace all these weatherboards. My father's got a bunch of weatherboards. I've got one out there that's probably <laughs> could be a little bit better than it actually is. It's sort of just been left outside for a little bit too long without any more than priming paint on and the priming paint they have from over here is actually pink and that started to flake off and yeah but I'll probably have to use that to be able to do both sides of the gable but I mean they've got splits in them they're just fucked and before too long it's it's you know going to be getting through into the framing which is just going to go from bad to dangerous um, so yeah anyway I don't know if it's really expected to rain I'll have to check the forecast as I'm saying but uh, I'm hoping to do this uh, before too long now, I've got a do a bit of bank stuff involving um, this whole mortgage deal with me mother. Um, this bank is the fucking biggest pain in the ass to deal with. Rural bank. Oh, shit. You ever been into a bank where they got signs advertising rural bank products and the teller doesn't know anything and the fucking manager doesn't know anything and next thing the manager's on the help line that's like this, you know, civilian 
helpline to find stuff out. And I'm like, what? It's almost like going to a Ford dealership and you've got an ad for a new car in the window, you know, big poster. And you go in there and the car dealer doesn't know anything about it. You know, the salesman doesn't know anything about it. And then he asks the manager, next thing the manager's on the phone to Ford headquarters saying, do we stock these cars while well, he's got a big ad for it in the fucking window? I mean, that's how ridiculous it is dealing with this bank that uh, holds the mortgage to this place. Anyway, after that point, I might have a go at the giant perpetual spinach patch, but um, still got a Ford wire and a bunch of other things for that, and a few star pickets and whatnot. And yeah, sometime in there, I got to spray a few box horns for my father, and I might even have a go at some of the ones down here as well, because uh, some of them just need cutting and rolling into piles. Um, by about that time, though, I'll probably be uh, back looking for a, a job and do that in between job searching. So, anyway, I just thought I'd uh, give you all a bit of a live update on uh, what's happening without having to uh, wait another couple of weeks to find out. And, uh, yeah.